alongside him in the backfield. And he'll take the football. And he's got some room. Walton to the 29-yard line. 14-yard gain for Mark Walton, who averaged nine yards a carry in their opening game three weeks ago. I'll tell you what, I really like this offensive line. The freshman, Navon Donaldson, you see he's continued to go throughout the game. We haven't seen anything resembling a huddle from either team thus far. Walton going nowhere. It'll be second and ten. In the Rockets' territory, Walton cuts it back. Breaking past everybody. Mark Walton's gone. 49-yard touchdown for Miami. The 44-yard touchdown run for Walton, his third TD of the season. One of the most explosive backs. Look at the patience. Look at the vision that he's having. And by him having that, he allowed the line to clear down the defensive line, and he cut it back and went right up the middle. And it's very hard to catch it. I love his patience. After the play was over. Got the breakaway like speed, too. Walton's got room again. Mark Walton, does he have the breakaway speed this time? Taken down inside the five. He's over 100 yards on the day already. Wow, 82 yards on that sprint. Defensively, Toledo came into this game giving up over 200 yards rushing per game. And it seems to me that they're going to allow Mark Walton to may have 200 by himself before the end of the first half. We talked about his vision, but look Not at him. the penalty, though. From the 36, Mark Walton's first carry of the second half is a big one. So explosive when he gets his hand on the rock. 17 that yards is the end of the first on the and Mark Rick did say that he doesn't like the red shirt guys anymore. He said it's hard enough to keep guys here for four years, let alone five. Mark Walton might be just a three-year guy the way he has run the ball today. That's his eighth carry of the day. And he's over 170 yards on those eight totes. Now, let's not get it twisted. Since Mark Walton has came back into the football game, he has lit a fire up under this offense. Ten yard. Loss on the play. Second and 20. Rozier sets up the screen to Walton. Tyler Gauthier had the lead block. And still a ways to go on the upcoming third down. That was very good. Walton shimmies past one man and spins through the grasp of another. Another 12-yard gain for Mark Walton. Like every time he touches the ball, it's a first down. If you want to stay in good graces, you got to feed the guy who is going to feed you back. They lost that. Mark Walton again. Jimmy's to the outside, putting defenders in blenders. Down to the 27-yard line. I thought he had a problem with his foot earlier. But when you see this jump cut, he presses the line of scrimmage. Oh, nothing's there. Whoop. That's good football. Great eyesight and way to finish the run. And he's had a 200-yard day. And he's got it. Near the first down marker. This was before the play when Toledo called the timeout. Walton trying to talk his way back in there. Do you think he knew he had 199 yards? Do you think he knew he was just one yard short?